If you're a public speaker and you've been speaking for some time and have studied the subject, you will know that the most powerful part of any speech is the story or stories within that speech because this is what arouses the emotion and people make decisions from emotions, not from logic. So what have you done to become a better storyteller? Nearly anyone can tell a story, just about everyone. But can you tell it well? Can you tell it in such a fashion that it does arouse those emotions? so that you can persuade people to make decisions based on what they gleaned from the, the message in the story. Now we know a direct appeal without story doesn't work. Statistics don't work. You can tell statistics about how many hundreds of thousands of people died, for example, of malnutrition and the people listening to the story remain, listen to the statistics, remain pretty well unmoved. Tell one story about one person, one child, for example, with which, with whom they can identify, because the story is long enough for them to become involved and identify and feel empathy for the person in the story, then that's a different matter. But the secret, of course, is to be able to tell the story well. Have you done anything as a speaker to increase your ability to tell stories well? Have, for example, you written short stories which arouse emotion? That's one way to do it. Have you read lots of books on short stories yourself which appeal to the emotions. There are many ways in which you can become a better storyteller. Practice, of course, is the main thing, but just practicing in itself is not enough. You have to be able to get the feel of the story in yourself first. You have to develop that certain sensitivity and along with it, the words, the powerful words which will bring home the story to the listener and move them. Don't neglect building up your storytelling skills. The difference between a story and a good story is the difference between just being interesting or making a point which stays with them forever. If you tell a story well and it arouses their emotions, they will remember that story well after your name and the event in which they heard the story fades from memory. But the message in the story, that is never lost. I've had examples where people have said to me, oh, I remember that story. I couldn't remember your name, but... And 20 years had elapsed between when I told the story the first time and when I told it the second time. They remembered the story. They didn't remember me. They couldn't even recall exactly where they'd heard it, but they remembered the story. Storytelling and the ability to tell stories really well is very important if you are to become a persuasive, influential, powerful speaker. Learn how to tell stories well and keep learning. It's a lifelong job. If you want to become the best you can ever become and keep on moving towards that, learn how to tell stories and tell them well.